Hey guys, it's Haig here, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to remove the safe PC kit PUP off your computer. This is a uh, potentially unwanted software. It's not exactly malware, but it could be classified as unwanted because it will get installed when you download other software and you're, uh, it's off, it's called a software offer. When you don't untick a box, it might install this as well, and you don't want it on your system. It will list that you got lots of some registry errors. But in order to actually fix these, you would have to purchase the full version. So you could see here that this program doesn't have any benefit to the user. It's just a money grab, and it's actually a compu uh, potentially unwanted program. Bleeping Computer has made an article about how you can actually remove this. I'm going to leave the link to this in the description box of how you remove it. And uh, you can follow along on the removal guide. But if you want to uh, learn how to remove it real fast here, just watch my video because I'm going to show you here how I can actually remove it. Alright? So, um, uh, what you're going to do is while it runs, you're going to make sure we uh, terminate the process, okay? So we want to shut down the SAPC kit from running. So we're going to go all the way down to the taskbar, and we're going to right-click, and we're going to go into Task Manager. And then when Task Manager opens, we're going to locate the safe PC kit here running in the process, all right? We're going to right click and we're going to end that process. That's going to terminate the process. And then we're going to actually exit out of that. And when we do that, we're we've we're going to find the icon for it. I'm going to delete that one, but this is the main icon for it, the safe PC kit. We're going to right click on that icon. We're going to come down to properties. Then when you have that open, we're going to come down to here where it says open file location. And then here we're going to locate a file that's called uninstall with free zeros. It may be different for you, but we want to find the uninstall. We're going to click on that. And then that's going to go ahead and it's going to actually ask you if you want to remove safe PC kit from the computer. And that's going to uninstall it. And at this point, we want to make sure we run some other softwares that we have here, just in case there's leftover residue from it. So I do recommend you run Hitman Pro Malwarebytes Anti-Malware, which I don't have installed right now, so I'm going to have to go get that. But I recommend you install the Hitman Pro ADW Cleaner Junkware Removal Tool and do some scans of it. So first of all, we'll do a scan with a Junkware Removal Tool. And again, I'll have the link for these programs in the description box that you can download for yourself, alright? So when Junk World Removal Tool opens, we're just going to actually, uh, it's going to say here to press any key to continue. We're just going to press any key to continue. It may fail to create a store port. I'm on a virtual machine. Don't worry if it doesn't work, but I'm going to click another again to continue. It's going to start searching processes and all kinds of stuff. And it may not find anything, because I don't, ha but or it may find other threats for you. It will be different. So just let this software run. And while that runs, I'll actually pause the video. And then we're going to go have a go with ADW Cleaner and Hitman Pro. Alright, when that scan's done, it's going to create a log report, find it, tell me what it's found and removed. It doesn't find anything for me, because there's probably nothing on my computer, because <laughs> I've got rid of the half of it already, but you may have other stuff on it. So it doesn't hurt to run these softwares, okay? So we'll now go around ADW Cleaner. We'll also run Hitman Pro. I'm actually not going to show you how to run every software. You just want to run these and scan your computer. And you can also check out the removal guide for this too in the description box if you're having issues with uh, this program. It's all right, but um, I don't even think I'll find anything because we've just uninstalled it, and we may find some leftover registry keys from it. But I mean, I got a pretty clean computer, so. But for you guys, that may be a different story. You may have a lot more of infection, so it's doesn't hurt to run these softwares like ADW Cleaner and Hitman Pro as well. Oh, so you can see here that actually ADW Cleaner, now that I ran it, has actually found some of it right here. So there's Safe PC Kit, some actually leftover files that weren't removed. So that's why we run these different softwares. And then we're just going to click Clean. 
and it's going to go ahead and it's going to remove it but it says it must restart probably the computer to complete the removal process so that's probably going to go ahead and restart and remove some of that when it reboots and after that we're just going to run a scan with Hitman Pro as well and then you can try to download Malwarebytes I won't make a video I'll leave Malwarebytes out because I don't want to just uh, because it would take too long to make this video I'm trying to keep it under 10 minutes long but I'd uh, I'll have the link for all the softwares in the description box and if you're having problems still with this uh, software getting rid of it I actually uh, have the removal guide from bleeping computer also in the description box so you can actually have the handwritten guide to help you out if you need more assistance removing that and I also offer remote malware removal support so if you guys need some help I have a uh, remote support you can come to me on Facebook or I have the phone number in the description box that you can call me at and I'll actually remotely remove this for you I charge $25 for one hour and $50 for unlimited hours I used to charge just 25 bucks but because the fact is that I found myself helping with people with computers with malware related issues I've found myself uh, helping people out for hours so I had to raise the price there if you need my assistance remotely head over to my Facebook page that links in the description box okay so now on to hitman pro you can run hitman pro as well and just click next and scan your computer with hitman pro and see if you can find any more uh, additional pieces of malware and maybe some tracking cookies and that will clean off the computer if you enjoy my videos remember to comment right and subscribe at this point you should have the uh... you should have the safe pc kit completely off the computer it should alright so um, I hope you enjoyed my videos I hope that helped remove this out off the computer and uh, see you later